Hi all, new experiment today. Neymar versus Mbappe. Right, so Neymar is going to be at Manchester City and Mbappe is going to be at Man United. I mean, the hatred rivalry between the both is going to be very, very interesting. Right, so... They're going to have like a war together, you know, see who becomes top. Will it be Man United? Will it be Manchester City? But Neymar and Mbappe are not really going to actually like each other, are they? Both at rival clubs. They're both going to want to get one over each other. Who's going to do it? Who? We're going to go two years into the future and see who wins the golden boot, who wins the Ballon d'Or out of the two players, who wins the leagues, the Champions League, all of it. Hope you're going to like this save, because if you do this experiment, I will do a part two. Let me know what you think in the comments, and I will do a part two and see how this experiment goes. Right, no more further ado, let's get right into it. Right guys, we start off this FM20 experiment, Neymar versus Mbappe. Right, we're two years into the future. How have they both got on? What have they won? Player of the Year, the Golden Boot for the season, the Ballon d'Or. Let's go and check. As we know, Neymar at Manchester City, Mbappe at Manchester United. The rivalry between these two teams, they hate each other. Man United don't like Man City, do they? You know, they're both big Manchester clubs and the one is always fighting over the other to actually say who is the best team You know Man United have won a lot of trophies But so have Manchester City and they are slowly starting to catch Man United up aren't they? So you know Will they do it in this episode? So let's go to Manchester City first Neymar already their key player and if we look on here Neymar is already an icon brilliant absolutely brilliant Man City estimated value two billion pounds so if we have a look at landmarks in 2020 they become charity shield winners that's with Neymar. Neymar was appointed as captain. And this year just gone, 2021, they become Premiership winners. So let's have a look. We go to Neymar now. He can play anywhere on the left as a winger or what have you. Advance forward, whatever you want him to do. Technique on point. This guy is a beast. 29 years of age now. Look at it. Passing. Tackling. Tackling's bad, you know, but you know, you've got to have some bad ones to have some good ones. Okay. Penalty taken decent. Passing. Free kicks, first touch, finishing, dribbling, crossing corners. Everything only 120, but you know, a couple of 19s, and he's still very pacey with 16 at the age of 29. Looking very, very good since he's been here these two years. 63 appearances he has made with 24 goals, brilliant ratio, absolutely brilliant. We go to here. 
go to career stats. That over the two seasons, 11 goals in 2020, and then 13 goals in 2021. So, you know, been doing very, very well, plus the assists. Don't think that's good enough to win Golden Boots. But we shall have a look in a bit. So let's go and have a look at Man United. Check how they are doing. So, Mbappe, key player, not captain as of yet. Two billion valuation the same, Man United. He's an icon already after two seasons. I mean, doing well. So from here, 2020 Euro Cup winners. So Mbappe's got a medal from that. European Super Cup runners-up. And FA Cup runners-up. They haven't won the league, though. So, you know, have a look at Mbappe. Look at it. He is only still 22 years of age. Unbelievable. 20 on pace. The guy is absolute rapid. And I mean rapid. Look at it. Dribbling, 19. Finishing, 18. First touch, 17. And it goes along across the board. 68 appearances for Man United. 32 goals. Phenomenal. The first season for Man United in 2020 had 18. I think that beat Neymar, didn't it, by one? And the second season, 14. So doing very, very well for Man United. Don't know why it says 159 mil paid there. Pretty sure they didn't pay anything. This is an experiment. But hey, why it says that? Doesn't matter, does it? Right, if we check all his other stuff, and we check Neymar's as well. Just look. He was put in Player of the Year for Man United by the supporters. Brilliant, brilliant, that is. He has just been doing really well along the board. Look at this. All the way to here, look. Team of the week he's got. Got that mostly. He was shortlisted for World Footballer of the Year. He came second. The shock of that is. Neymar wasn't even on there. And he's not anywhere on actually winning it ever. So that's a weird one. Ronaldo eventually won it. But yeah, weird one that. Where are we going? Right, here we go. So shortlisted for that. Where's it got there? Player of the month. Load of those he has got. Look at it. English Premier Division player of the month. The young player. Team of the week. Best young player. He's only young. He's only 21. He's going to get on there. That's for sure. Runners up in the FA Cup. Like we know. And here we go. Look at this. Broke the Man United records. For the most player of the match awards in the season. Nin 19. So on this experiment. It looks like. We haven't looked at all the Messi stuff yet. But it looks like. He has got the edge. On Messi at the moment. Uh, Messi. Why am I saying Messi? Neymar. He's got the edge over him. But, as we saw, Manchester, Manchester City won the league, didn't they? So, not quite all there yet. But, in the awards and all that. His report. The guy. Just a beast of a player. I mean, Mbappe, isn't it? Let's have a quick look at Neymar's. 
Man City because they won the league. Milestone. So if we go all the way down here, what did he win? Doesn't look as though that much actually. Won the charity shield, which you know. Player of the weeks. Player of the month. Named in Brazil season best 11. That's good. Winners of the Carabao Cup. Winners of the Premiership in 2020. Best 11. Team of the year. Named as Man City captain. Brazil captain. Okay, that's good. Winners of the Shield again. He was shortlisted for Football of the Year in 20. He didn't get anywhere though. So, you know, he was good enough to be named on there. I mean, done really well. He has literally done really well. But I'd say, yeah, just the edge in Mbappe and what he's done and goals, he's just about snuck it. Only just. There's 195 paid from PSG to go to Man City, but it wasn't. Experiment, why would there be money involved? But like I said, he is very, very, very good though. Look at this. Awesome. Shots on target, look, dribbles, passes. Just a sublime player. We go to form. Show it out properly, look. Not bad, eh? If you love this, this content... Want to see more of these experiments? I really do enjoy doing these experiments. You know, it's fun. And you're obviously liking them as well. So what do you think? Would you like to see a part two of this? You want to see a part two? Whack down in the comments. You know, and I'll do a part two. You know, because they still got time. 29 Neymar. 22 Mbappe. Mbappe could go on. Just future down the line. Might evenly do one with Justin Mbappe once Neymar retires. But anyway, yeah, if you want to see a part two, let me know. Subscribe to the channel so you can see these more videos, experiments. Click the bell notification so you never miss said experiments. And all of that lovely stuff. Twitter, all of it. Come visit me. All my social medias down below. Right, guys, remember... Part two if you want it. Guys, catch you in the next video.